Well today we've launched uh, the Nosley Cleaner, Safer, Greener Charter and that's really about making it clear for everybody who, who lives and works in the borough uh, about whose responsibility it is clearly to look after the environment that we live and, and we work in. So um, you, uh, you see a burnt out car, some uh, fly tipping, uh, graffiti. For example, the, uh, the charter will explain very, very clearly what is expected to remove those problems and what kind of standards that you can expect from individual or from joint agencies to deal with that particular issue. Uh, it's not just about the council, uh, it's about other partner agencies, it's about KHT, it's about the police, the fire service, all the other agencies that we deal with. So that for example, you know, anybody is not, is not ringing five or six numbers to try and get a bin emptied or a piece of litter taken away. Hey, my name is Darren Collins, I've been working now at the parks um, since about February. Um, and what we've done is we've been basically just sort of revamping the parks around um, Nosley and Halewood. Um, as you can see with this one, we had a lot of vandalism in um, saw pits, but you look around and everything else, um, the vandalism now is basically next to nothing. But what we're trying to do is trying to encourage people to come in into the parks because it's, it's like a, a free facility sort of thing. Um, basically, it's just like leisure time for them, it's just somewhere for, for, where they can bring the kids and stuff. Just a few years ago, uh, this was just a piece of open space with an old pond in the middle. But the council has uh, invested in this area and made it the lovely place it is now for mostly people to enjoy. Uh, it's a lovely piece of open space. Uh, the parks are very nice, very well maintained. There's lots of wildflowers here. And it's open for people to use in the area. Now the residents themselves, they say they're passing through all the time every day. They're always passing comments and stuff like that. Um, but I think it's, it's more of a case of, because the park looks the way it does now, people are taking pride in what they've got. If you, I mean, if that could be passed on to all the parks around the area and everything else, then that would be great. But even like the other parks where we've been looking after, it, it's, it's a similar sort of case. It's down to Darren and this team, we've done an excellent job all year round in bringing the park up to this particular standard and keeping it this way. Um, and it's good to see that it is used as well all year round, and especially at this time of year when very rarely the sun is out shining. <laughs>